I was tempted to start this video by just whipping my hair back and forth for the greatest hit ever by Willow Smith but oh, I just got this done today and it still kind of hurts for the uninitiated basically when you get your hair braided you kind of have to like pull at your actual hair and it still takes tight for a while so it's a bit uncomfortable shaking my head around will just make it worse so and this is just going to be another roundy video yay i recent i within like the last hour i finished watching the third episode of game of thrones overall i liked it and had that same feeling that i get of every game of thrones episode where the screen goes to black and i'm like what the episode can't be over already but it always is but there was a scene that they changed from the books that i didn't like at all hated the way they changed it quite a few people aren't happy with it, where they changed it either i'm not going to go into details for people who haven't watched it don't want to spoil it but if you've read the books and you've seen the episode you obviously know what scene i'm talking about i'm actually nearly done with the first part of the dance with dragons right now and yeah i mean i'm enjoying it some parts feel like dragging on feel like he's kind of maybe got a few too many narratives going on but it looks good I was reading Cat's Cradle by Kurt Vonnegut at the same time and I was enjoying that too but the difference with with um, George R.R. Martin like this narrative is so like what's going to happen next driven that I just kind of let Cat's Cradle fall by the wayside which I will definitely pick up again because I was actually really enjoying it. It was just it was just so funny and so much irony and deadpan humour and but just so many ridiculous things happening that you kind of just accept it and then you're like of course these few people just happen to be here too but it's definitely a really good book and I definitely recommend reading it and obviously the Song of Ice and Fire series too but everyone knows about that already. Um, I'm going back to uni in two days because I am working a UCAS thing and um, I have it's going to be weird going back. It won't be the same because most people are still off campus, but it will be weird because being home, I kind of miss uni, but at the same time, part of me is glad to be home. So I don't know. Weird mixed feelings about that because also most people here have, in the UK, I mean, have a third term, so they still have an uptown being to go, but my uni only has two terms. So yeah, don't don't really have much else to say on that been listening to a lot of Haim lately just basically on repeat to listening to them non-stop and not listening to anything else Watsky should be coming out with a new album later this year which I'm looking forward to and um yeah that's it really those are the thrilling things happening in my life sent notes of the day getting this done so yeah so if what well, let me know what you're up to and stuff and i'll see you tomorrow and i hope you're all doing well bye